And I'm sorry, but like, I don't give people false hope. And so I'm coming from a place of love, also a place of inspiration for you. So if you need to get inspired, watch this replay. Do not turn this off. I'm Emily Benson. I am the Forbes and InStyle featured founder of The Fashion Truck. You can find that at fashiontruck.com. And I'm the current founder, proud founder of Stylish and Successful and the host of the Boost Your Boutique podcast. I am beyond excited to be back here on Facebook Live. I'm going to share this in my beautiful, positive space that I've created for women who are in the fashion industry, whether that is a direct selling company, a mobile boutique, or a a uh, retail business. It's called the Fashion Truck Tribe. Based, hi Kim, welcome. It's based on my um, the name of my business, the Fashion Truck. So I invite you to come over in there. We're having some great conversations in there about branding and how to start your truck and how to how to keep going. How to use Shopify, guys. If you're not using Shopify, please, dear God, be using Shopify. Um, if you have an e-commerce site, so I'm going to share it over there very quickly. And then I'm going to get right into why I give people hope. I'm going to talk about some of my story personally, why I don't have a truck anymore. Because, um, guys, if you're feeling today like things are weird, things are weird. <laughs> Tomorrow night's the full moon. Are you ready for it? Give me some hearts if you're feeling the energy of the full freaking moon. Because let me tell you. This full moon is in my sign, Scorpio. If you're a Scorpio too, give me some hearts. Let me know when your birthday is. Um, and either way, if you're watching live, you're watching the replay, tell me who you are. Tell me where you're from. Tell me what the heck store you own or hope to own. I want to know about it because I want to give you a lot of hope <laughs> because that's what I'm here for. So I'm going to share this on a page I manage called, I wonder, Holly, if you're watching, you could do this for me sometimes, huh? Um, you guys, Holly is my like amazing assistant. Okay, it's in a group. Sorry, the Fashion Truck Tribe. You can find it uh, just by searching the search bar above. Oh my God! I, how did I not know you were a Scorpio, Holly? Holy crap! Um, okay, I'm sharing this in my group, and then I'm closing my computer because I'm seeing comments. Hi, Yurani. Good to see you. I saw your post in our Six Figure Blueprint, guys. Six Figure Blueprints officially closed. Okay, so if you want to be in it and be on the wait list, you can send us an email at hello at stylishandsuccessful.com, and we'll get you in the next round. Okay. I also have some announcements of some amazing stuff that's coming up. I just like, oh my gosh. Okay, so number one, why do I give people hope? You want to know? And again, this person said that I give people false hope, which is bullshit. Okay, because honestly, my results speak for themselves. I don't need to defend myself. Here's the deal. The reason I give people hope is because look around you. How many negative people did you encounter today? How many people did you come across that said, no, you can't do that. Um, I'm trying. I'm trying to do this. I'm trying to do that. Like, I'm done with people telling me I'm trying to do this and that. Like, stop trying. Start thinking. Start believing that you can have whatever you want because you can. Okay? This is real. Real, real, real. And like... I'm just done with people saying that it's not possible or you can't do it. If I thought, number one, when I wanted to move to New York City, do you know what I did? Okay, this I was 22, 23 years old. I was working in Ohio. I had friends in New York. And you know what I did? I was like, I want to move to New York. I knew that my boss was going to be leaving. And so what I did is I didn't say, oh, I can never work in New York. Oh, it's so hard to work in New York, blah, play victim. I said, you know what? What companies do I want to work at in New York? And so I found those companies online. I was like, I want to work at The Gap. I want to work at Limited, has an office there. I interviewed with New York and company. I literally emailed all of the HR people at all these companies and got interviews over Martin Luther King Day weekend went and stayed with my friends, got interviews at all these places, got callbacks for a few. I wasn't right for a few of them, okay? Um, within, let's see, I, got, I decided to go to New York in December. I said, I'm going to be, I don't care if you even have a position. I just want to come and talk to you and show you my portfolio and meet you, okay? At one of the places that I went to just meet someone, they didn't even have a job open for me. I literally, three quarters of the interview, the woman from HR said to me, 
Uh, you know, Emily, like we just actually created this position that you would be perfect for. Okay, that was like January 15th is Martin Luther King. On March 1st, I was living in New York on the Upper East Side in a corporate apartment with literally my dream job that changed the course of my life, okay? So when people tell you you can't do something, guess what? I take that as a challenge to be like, bye, I'm going to go do it. And so for me, when I work with you in any capacity, even if it's just this, even if it's just this, even if you're watching me on YouTube, you're watching me on Facebook Live, I want you to know that there is nothing you cannot do. And that's not me sitting here being like, rah, rah. It's because I've done it over and freaking over, okay? Like, there is literally nothing that will stop me from getting what I want. I have another Facebook group, which I have neglected, and it's called the I Do What I Want Club. Because listen, I decide I'm going to do something, and I go do it. And you know what? Not only do I do it, I knock it out of the freaking park. Like, hello, did I think the fashion truck was going to be in Forbes? In InStyle? No. But did I believe it was going to be super successful? Oh, hell yes, I did. Okay, the number one thing that you guys need to understand is that the first place, <laughs> the first place that your own true dreams come from is in here. You have to believe in yourself. And I believe in you, okay? Because I believe in myself. So that's the bottom line. So if you're looking for someone to be like, be your cheerleader, that's me, okay? And I'm not giving you false hope because frankly, I don't really believe in hope that much. I'm going to give you my skills. I'm going to give you training. I'm going to give you mindset work. I'm going to give you a whole bunch of stuff. And can you see I'm getting red because I'm like so passionate? Like literally I have a physical reaction to this because I'm so passionate about helping you be successful. Okay, wait. I want to read the comments. Hi, guys. You ready? Three. I don't know what that means. Hi, Nancy. Are you still there, Nancy? Give me some hearts. I hope you are. Kim. Kim says, my hubby is full of negativity. I love being around positive and inspiring people. You're such a breath of fresh air. Okay. So Kim, what I want to tell you, this is coming up for a lot of people lately. And, um, a there, okay. That better be Nancy. Um, so what I want to tell you is that you cannot change other people through trying to change them. The only way you can change other people is through your actions and through example. And I had to learn this sometimes the hard way, honestly. And <laughs> hi, Jeannie. I love you. Um, you're the bomb.com too, Jeannie. Um, and Joni, I think I saw you give me a like. Hi. Um, here's the thing. You can't change people by telling them what to do. And I told this story in my... Um, I told this story on my six-figure blueprint. So, like, I'm obsessed. Like, I have a very close-knit family. And I've been into essential oils for a while. And so I got my mom a diffuser. I gave my mom my diffuser. I didn't buy her a new one because we were moving. So I gave her a diffuser. I gave her all these oils. And, like, four or five months went by. And she was like, I don't really know how to use it. You'll have to teach me. Like, I mean, she wasn't, like, feeling it, right? And that's fine. So over Christmas, when I was hanging out at my parents' house, I started using the diffuser. I started like, whatever, like someone was stuffy, so I put some eucalyptus, some citrus, right? It was like going, going, going. And so my mom and my sister were like, this is really cool. Like, what is this stuff? Literally like two weeks later, they call me and they're like, so um, we went and we got, my sister's like, I got a diffuser for my computer and I've been using the peppermint oil you bought me and da, 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 da. So here's the thing. No amount of me telling my family how amazing essential oils were, we're going to get them to get on board, right? I had to like just lead by example. I had to like show them through my actions that it was helping me because I use peppermint oil for my headaches. And so that's the thing. With your husband, like your husband, you can't tell him to change. You can't be like, honey, be more positive. Like that just, it doesn't work. So what you have to do is you have to work on your energy and you have to raise your energy to being positive. And guess what? I guarantee you it will rub off. And I had clients, right? Janie, Janie and Ashley. Janie and Ashley said that they thought that I had broken into their husband's, one of their husband's phones and messaged them something positive because they were like, Emily, they're like, 
you're rubbing off on our husband now. And I was like, yeah, right. But you're actually, they were rubbing off on their husbands, right? Cause they were working with me. They were getting more positive and like things are changing for them. Right. So like, yeah, it's me, but it's also that ripple effect. Like Joni, yes. Hi. Yeah. Family. It's just like that. Right. And I feel like at the end of the day too, it's like my dad always talked about this growing up. He would always say, you have a ripple effect on your family. And, and I, I even think you have a ripple effect on more than you might even know. Um, because our energy, we literally are vibrating beings. So our energy is literally like eh, vibrating all over the place. And like, I hope this comes up with a good screenshot for Facebook. Ah, um, we're literally vibrating. And so the deal is, is like, we have to be aware of our energy because our energy is just getting shot out all the time. Right? So the cool part about energy and the cool part about like that ripple effect that my dad always talked about was that if that ripple effect was good, then good things are going to happen. It's when that ripple effect is negative. Mm. But like, here's the deal is that whosoever story is stronger will win. Right. And I talk about this too. I I learned this from a couple coaches that I worked with and they always said, whosoever story is stronger wins. So if you're the more positive person, like if your positive story comes from deep down here, really like solar plexus centered, and you feel like, that story becomes stronger than your husband's negativity, then that will win, right? And I hate saying win, lose, whatever. You, you understand what I'm saying, though, is that your positivity will always win. And so that's like, you know, I am not like, I'm not positive all the time. I come on here and I'm like, hi, as a kite. I get really excited to coach. I get really excited to help people. Um, but I have my moments where I'm frustrated. I have my moments where I am like feeling down and pessimistic, right? So the thing is, is that you've got to work on yourself. And today I was talking to a friend about how um, there's a quote from a book called The Big Leap. And if you haven't read The Big Leap, it's a really awesome book. I highly suggest it. It totally changed my life. Um, And he says in that book that business is ultimately a spiritual path. And spirituality, I'm not talking about like religion or like, I don't want to talk about God or anything. I just, I think that when you choose to have a business, it does become part of you and you do change because of that business. Like, right. I've, I've sent emails about this to my list where I say like, I've shown them pictures of me in 2014, 2013 to me now, like I look like a different person, like not obviously like that different. I still have blonde hair or whatever. But <laughs> I look different. My skin was not this glowy. I was not like, ja, ja. I was definitely not feeling good. And this, and this is the second reason why I give people hope. Because like two, three, four years ago, I was not in a good place. I was not feeling good about myself. I was not feeling good about my business. And I wish so much that someone like me existed and that I found her sooner. And look, I'm getting so hot. I'm so passionate, you guys. I physically like react to like helping people. Okay, hold on. Kim, I need to work on my story. Yeah, and listen, that's like a daily practice, Kim. Like for me, my my positivity comes from my daily practice of listening to Abraham Hicks, um, reading books on personal development, talking to Greg all the time about how to feel good. Listen, if you're watching this, I want you after to Google the emotional guidance scale. Okay. It's by Abraham Hicks. And what we do is we focus on finding a feeling of relief. So like I said, when I'm frustrated, what I do is I go to that guidance system. The next thing up from frustrated, I know, because I often am frustrated. Um, not often, but I'm, that's like how I, how I feel sometimes. Um, when I feel frustrated, the next step up from frustrated is pessimistic. So I'm like, oh, I'm so frustrated with this situation. That, that place isn't open. I wish it was open, da, 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 da. And so then I'm just like, well, I need to feel pessimistic. Oh, that store's never going to be open. I'm never going to get to shop at it. This is terrible. And then I have to get to board and da, 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 da. So I'm, and I'm losing people because no one wants to hear this. Okay. Um, yeah. So work on your story. It takes daily practice, but listen, over time, as you work on this, it builds up. And like I said, back in 2014, 2013, I was like, Honestly, from the outside, I looked really successful. I had been in Forbes. I was making money. I was taking trips. I have a great boyfriend, had an apartment, all this great stuff. Inside, like, I was not happy. Something was missing, like, and I didn't know what it was. And so the thing is, is the reason why I want to give back to women, especially women entrepreneurs, especially women fashion entrepreneurs, 
is because I just wish there was someone like me who could have helped me sooner. Because honestly, I might still have my boutiques if I had run into someone like me sooner, right? I might still be there. But I didn't run into my coach that I first worked with until 2015 in the summer. And so I was kind of like on my way out already. And I was already searching for this higher power. And to be honest, like my path is to be here with you guys. I don't know what's in five years on this path. I know right now I love working with creative women, boutique owners. I love teaching, training, all this stuff. I love giving you hope because at the end of the day, again, like it's not hope. It's like, it's like being a cheerleader. Like you can do this. It is possible for you. And I want to show you how, because I didn't have anyone to show me how until it was too freaking late. And for me, like, I don't regret selling my truck. I don't regret closing my store. I know that I'm on the path I'm meant to be on. And I am really freaking proud of all that I accomplished in my truck. And I want you to be so proud of yourself too. And I want to show you how to do that. Right? So that's why I'm doing this. Okay. Like that's why I give people hope. And so, yeah, like I had, I had Chinese medicine today and she just really like, move some things around. Um, so that's why I like, I look a little cray, but listen, before I get to the third thing, cause honestly the third thing about why I give people hope is a pretty good one. So I want you to stay tuned, but I really need you to know something. Okay. I've had a lot of people reaching out to ask like, can I get in six for your blueprint? How do I work with you, Emily? I love watching your videos. I love, I have been spitting out free content for so long and I'm at this point now we six figure blueprint is closed I'm sorry like it's closed I can't I can't however I have three ways right now that you can work with me and some of those ways are in person oh, can you imagine you and me like jamming um, so I want to tell you about those. So the first way that is really for so many of you. So first of all, if you want to come, I'm going to be in Dallas. My first time in Texas, Dallas, Texas on June 13th, I am hosting a three hour workshop. Okay. in Downtown Dallas at the Adolphus hotel. We're going to go through busting down your money blocks. We're going to, I'm going to show you how to make a profit in your business. Cause guess what? It's possible. Despite what people want to say, false hopes, bullshit, crap, Ola, you can make a profit and you can have an amazing life in whatever fashion business you have. Cause I did. Um, and, and I'm going to show you how to do Facebook live. I'm going to teach you how to do this so you can make money too on Facebook live. Can you imagine? Oh my God. So that is June 13th. Tickets are available on my website or you can go to, I should write all these down. Holly, are you there? Can you type in the comments? Um, bit.ly slash it's B Y B booster boutique Dallas 17 is the link to get tickets. Tickets right now are $20 off the regular price. So they're going to be like that until Friday, this Friday at midnight, and then they're going to go up. So tickets are still available, but they're going to be $20 more if you wait. So don't wait if you know you're going to be in Dallas that day or you live near Dallas. I want to see your face. I want to help you. I want to train you. Okay. Like I can give you all the hope in the world, but like, I also want to train you. Um, so, um, the, the link, Holly, Holly, can you just type this? Holly bit.ly slash BYB. It's the booster boutique workshop in Dallas 17. So it's BYB Dallas one seven. Thanks. Okay. Dallas. The other way you can work with me is in person. You and me. I'm offering intensives. I'm coming back to the US. I'm really excited to be in the States and I want to work with you. So I'm going to be in Massachusetts. I'm going to be in Dallas and I'm going to be in Chicago. And so I'm offering three hour intensives. You, me, I'll come to your store. I'll come to your mobile boutique. What do you want me to do? I'll come. Let's do it. Let's work on visual merchandising. Let's work on your plan. Let's work on your assortment. Let's work on your pricing. Let's work on your mindset. Like, what do you want to work on? Let's do it for three hours. No bull crap. Let's get down to business. Okay. In your business. Those are available through my website. You can look. The dogs are excited about the intensives. Um, those are available. Go to stylishandsuccessful.com and you'll see work with me. Thanks, Holly. Um, work with me and then, um, one-on-one intensive. So three hours, you and me, 
Dallas, Massachusetts. They say Boston, but I'll come to Eastern Mass. Um, and Chicago, you guys, I'm going to be in Chicago. So if you're near Chicago, come to downtown Chicago. Let's do an intensive. Um, three hours, you and me, that's on my website. And then last but not least, if you are not in any of these areas, you're not in Six Degree Blueprint, you're not already working with me, and you're worried about price, okay? So I've heard people that are worried about price, which Lord knows, you know, I'm doing money mindset work all the time. So listen, I've reopened officially the Boutique Elite Membership. I had to like remember. I worked on the website all day yesterday. Guys, this is the thing. I do all my own work, okay? Like Holly helps me with stuff, but like I do all my own stuff. So hello. If you want something, you got to do it, right? Come to D.C. Sarah, I should come to D.C. Actually, my Aunt Joni lives in downtown D.C. I should come and see her. Um, I don't know. Joni, are you still there? Uh, should I come to D.C.? <laughs> do some intensives in D.C.? Um, so, Booster Boutique, no. So, Boutique Elite Membership is open. It's a monthly membership program. And you get a one-hour training, you get a worksheet that goes with it, you get a mindset, uh, a, a meditation, you get a book club suggestion. All of this every single month is new, okay? And if you miss, so I opened Boutique Elite membership in February. If you're, if you missed February, March, April, which were amazing, yes, the capitalization, yes, it does. If you, Holly, can you jump over to my website, Stylish and Successful, go to work with me, and then underneath it is the intensives. Could you post that link to um, the one-on-one intensives? Thank you. Thank you. I love Holly, you guys. Holly's my assistant. She's amazing. She, like, helps me get all this crap done. Um, <laughs> she's like, I can't do this without her anymore. I kind of depend on her. Um, so listen, uh, the membership. So what I did, you guys, so the first three months of the membership are amazing content. So if you missed the first three months, what I did is I actually bundled that up and I'm going to, if you want, sell that to you too as a package deal. Because you know what we did in the first three months? We did social media mastery, inventory management training. That alone is worth like $500, just that training. And then we did, oh, selling via relationships, which is all about how to get the 80% of sales from the 20% of your customers, which is like how boutiques work. And so, you guys, the value every month of the membership is $1,700, and it's $33 a month, okay? $33, and you can get the three additional months that you missed right away. So you get access to everything immediately after you pay, um, and Holly, this one is, um, maybe I'll jump back on my computer. You can get access to the three past months that we've done for $97. Okay, the total value on those is like $3,300, something crazy. And you get it, you get access immediately. So if you need help with inventory management, social media, all that stuff, thanks Holly. Um, and Holly, Booster Boutique uh, Elite, it's, it's bit.ly Boutique Elite 17. I did Boutique Elite 17, that's the membership site. Um, and so honestly, you guys, like the boutique elite membership site is crazy valuable. You get the one hour trainings. God, you just get so much. Hey, Salen, how are you? Let me look. I, someone else posted something. Rebecca. Hey, Rebecca. Um, I don't know if we've met. Hey girl, I listen to your podcast all the time. I love you. I love you too. Thank you. You give me so many ideas and tools. Woo! Yes. That's exactly what I mean. Right? Like, okay. So I love this, you guys. Last week, someone said I give people false hope, and I say that's bullshit because I don't give you hope. I give you tools, I give you training, and I am your biggest freaking cheerleader, right? That's what I say in the podcast, in the intro. I say, I am your best friend in boutique land, right? I love it. Okay, so boutique, okay, so you guys, Holly is posting. Thank you, Holly. You're amazing. So Holly's posting the membership, which I know, Salem, you're a member. We have new content this month, Money Mindset, good stuff. Uh, the one-on-one intensives, which are going to be in Boston area, Dallas, and Chicago. There's very limited space, very limited space on those because I'm super freaking busy when I travel, but I made time on certain days to do intensives. So if you want to work with me, like, let's do that. And then Dallas, Dallas tickets. 
Woo, woo, woo. Nicole, hey, you're coming to Dallas. I'm psyched. So you guys, I'm going to wrap this up. But listen, the last, the last reason why I give people hope is because if I can start a boutique in a truck when like no one else was doing this, make six figures a year, be in Forbes, be in InStyle. I, FYI, I've been in over 40 plus publications, okay? I've won awards. I won Most Stylish Boston. Can you imagine? I was in the Most Stylish with Hello, Tom Brady, and Giselle, literally my life hero, okay? If you don't know, I love Giselle. I freaking love Giselle. So if I can do that, like, why can't you? And why can't I teach you how to do that? Is that so bad? Because guess what? There's literally almost no one else teaching this. Ashley, Ashley Alderson is teaching this. That's it. Boutique Hub. No one else is teaching what I teach. Okay? And so that is why I do what I do. That's why I give you guys hope. Because at the end of the day, don't you want to be successful? Like last time I checked, you do. And I don't think there's a limit to how successful you can be. Okay? If you think there's limits on your life, you're not in the right place. <laughs> Uh, that is not a core belief of mine. My core belief is that you can do whatever you want. You can be whatever you want. You can have whatever you want. And if you want to question that, you can go watch The Secret. <laughs> right, Nicole? Nicole, watch The Secret. She's in. <laughs> Let me just read these comments. Nicole, hey, I'm glad you're here, Nicole. Um, Rebecca, I'm just having trouble bringing new people to my Facebook page. Rebecca, have you done Facebook Live? Have you tagged your Facebook Lives? Um, are you reposting? Do you have a group? Are you reposting? The thing about Facebook is you have to be really consistent. And I talk about that in, um, the training for boutique elite membership in February. I talk all about how to use the social, uh, how to use the Facebook algorithm to your advantage to get more people coming to your page. Um, so that might be something you want to look into. Like I said, it's three months of training for $97, which is like so damn cheap. Um, Nicole, sadly right now is the same day round trip. What are we talking about? Did I miss that? Round day trip. Sorry, Nicole. I don't know. Here we go. Dallas. Yes. Okay. Booster Boutique Workshop Dallas. You do live sales once a week. I don't know how to tag though. Okay. So to tag your live video. So number one, I would do more like in between stuff. Tell your story. Talk about what's going on in your business. Engage people. Ask them questions. Like, the deal is, is like if you're always selling to people, then they don't necessarily want to buy all the time. So you have to mix it up a little bit. I would say go live and like, A, I would split your inventory into two live sales a week. Um, I'm going to Dallas but driving from San Antonio and back the same day. Well, Nicole, you have to get some good books on tape. Honestly, do you know how much, when I used to drive my fashion truck, I literally like, like listened to podcasts. I listened to books on tape. Like I was a content consumer when I was in my truck. I was always driving. Um, so we'll just have to hook you up with some good audible books. That's like one good audible book, one way. And then like that, like back and forth. Um, so anyway, um, Rebecca, yeah, I think you should try to do two live sales a week, split your inventory. And yeah, right, Nicole? And I think um, you should go live doing other things. And I think as long as you're consistent posting in between, like that's the thing is people, you like you can't go, if you look at my Facebook page, Holly does an amazing job, guys, using Buffer and like creating content for this Facebook page to where like we get really amazing reach on this page. This page is growing really fast. And I haven't really spent that much money on advertising or boosting or anything like that. What we do is we ask questions. We... um post, you know, we post sometimes about what I'm doing. I come on Facebook live once, twice, sometimes three times a week. I'm going to come on more, a little bit more now, um, in the next week, just because I have a lot to talk about this week. Cause I'm super creative this week. <laughs> I had like a burst of energy on Saturday and it hasn't stopped. So I have topics for all this week, guys. I'll probably come on at night. So if you want to plan your night around my Facebook live, probably around the same time every night, I'll come on. Um, but listen, like, I think the thing with Facebook is everyone two years ago retreated to groups and I think groups are changing, the algorithms changing in groups. And so I think it would be really good if you're watching this and you have a Facebook group to come back to Facebook pages and really try to maximize how much you're posting. Use the scheduling app to help you do that. It does not decrease your reach. We've seen it. We, I pra listen, bottom line is, is anything I teach and tell you to do, I've probably done myself. And if I haven't done it myself and I've heard 
like it works or whatever, then I've heard it A, from a credible source, and B, I'm going to tell you like, oh, I haven't done that, but I've heard this works, right? Um, yes, and Holly is really good at social media, scheduling content. Yes, Holly is my expert here. I've basically delegated that because I can't deal with it anymore. Um, so I come on Facebook Live. This is what I'm good at. This is what I like to do. And that's what, listen, when I work with you as a client, like whether you're in a program or you work with me one-on-one, -on -one, like I want to exploit your natural talents. So like a lot of my clients, Janie and Ashley, who I don't know if Janie's still here, um, Janie and Ashley are like really, really, really good on camera. They're really fun to watch. And so we try to exploit that with them. We, I have them grow on Facebook Live all the time. That's really engaging for them. Um, and so, you know, I feel like it is about being consistent. It is about exploiting and it is about video. I'm sorry. If you're not comfortable doing Facebook live guys, you're not going to get very far in your business on Facebook. That's just, it's just a thing now. Like anyway, listen, um, I want to go eat dinner soon. So let me know if you have questions. Post questions below. If you're watching the replay, feel free to post questions. I check all my comments. I answer all my comments. Um, please, please, please post here. If you need to send me a message at hello at stylish and successful.com. We check that email. I'm not so great about Facebook messages. I try to keep up, but, um, we get a lot of messages every day. I get a lot of emails and I'm managing a lot of things right now. So listen, Dallas tickets are, go up on Friday. They go up $20 on Friday. If you want to work with me one-on-one -on -one while I'm back in the States, you have a month and a half to do it and I'm going to Europe. So get on that. <laughs> and if you, um, I highly suggest you join the Boutique Elite membership. It's $33 a month, which like, hi guys, you spend that at Target. And you're going to get an updated training every month, a book club, a meditation. You get one um, group coaching call a quarter. Our next quarterly call is in June. So that would be soon. So that gives you a chance to get on and get some coaching one-on-one -on -one from me during that call. So listen, you can cancel at any time. There's no strings attached. Um, it's a really amazing program and I offer it because it's a low price and um, really I'm a teacher and a trainer. I'm becoming more of a coach, but <laughs> I'm, I'm a teacher and trainer and a consultant more than anything. Okay, Rebecca, I'm going to read your... Um, Rebecca says there's too much... She has a page in a group, 200 members on the page, 800 in a group. She wants to move to the page. She's scared. She's losing your members. Well, listen, you're going to... So, Rebecca, um, if you want to join the membership, Holly posted the link above. It's bit.ly slash boutique elite 17. And the sign up is on that page. You just have to click. And if you want the next three months training, it's on that too. So you'll get charged for the three months that we already had, and then you'll get charged for this month, May, and then going forward, you'll get charged every month. It's a membership program, right? Um, so it's an auto bill. But listen, Rebecca, I think the thing is, like, to migrate those people over, you have to, like, tell them to move, right? So you have to say, listen, I'm going to start moving all my sales to my page. I'd love for you to join me. If you don't want to join me, fine, bye. Because, like, the thing is, like, you can always find new customers. Guys, that's the thing with retail. The average lifespan of a customer is three years. So you really always need to be acquiring new people as customers, okay? You can't rely on the same people all the time. Yes, there are going to be people who, like, come back, come back, come back. But, again, average lifespan of a customer is three years. So if you're in this for the long haul, you constantly have to be focused on, yes, taking care of your VAPs and taking care of the people that you love, but also getting new customers. The only way you can get new customers is by putting yourself out there, being in a public place. That's why I love business pages, being in a public place and letting people know what you're doing. Okay. So that's why I advocate for business pages. I think that groups are like, I mean, I have my group obviously, but like, I don't, I don't know if you've noticed, but I'm not in there that much guys. I like say hi and welcome to everyone. I probably check it once every two days and I answer questions. Um, but that's it. It's really a community for other people. I don't necessarily like, I like facilitating. I like adding my expertise, but I don't, um, I'm not doing like daily challenges in there. Like I don't, I don't want to do that. You have to do what lights you up period. What lights me up is doing these Facebook lives. What lights me up is giving you false hope through all these Facebook lives. No. Anyway, I started off by saying that someone said last week that 
I give you guys false hope. And I think that's bullshit. Uh, Cause the deal is I also train and I teach and like I give you actual strategies that are working for people. I have clients who made $50,000 extra in a month. I had a client last year who made an extra $40,000 over two months and she bought her dream car in cash. Hello? You guys, I have a LuLaRue consultant that I worked with last year when I was just starting out and she, um, she made her money back in like a month and then made all this money to move to Florida. Like, you know, I don't work on hope. I work on like results and executors. If you're an executor, you do very well with me because I'm like, do this and it works. So, okay. Is there any other questions? I want to finish up because Greg is waiting for me to go to dinner. Um, but thanks for joining me guys. I do want you to check out. I will do one more plug for Dallas event. Live event is going to be amazing the bombas you guys there's fireworks here in guatemala all the time like today at noon i was at chinese medicine and there were fireworks going off at noon they love to celebrate things here people are very happy here it's very fun to be here um so dallas event intensives boston dallas chicago throughout may and june and then um boutique elite membership 33 dollars a month guys and if you want the past trainings social media inventory management and social selling, basically social selling. Those are available for $97. Plus you get the book clubs and the meditations. So you get three, three and a half, four hours of training, book clubs. The meditations are really good too. I create all the meditations myself because soon enough I'll be a yoga meditation and spiritual teacher. <laughs> Give me like 20 years. <laughs> um, uh, but yeah, so Thanks for joining me. Rebecca, thanks for joining. Um, Holly posted all the links to everything in this thread. If you're watching the replay, thank you. Let me know who you are. Tell me what you need help with. Um, and guys, if you have any suggestions for future Facebook Lives, post them below or send us a message because I'm always looking for ideas on what you guys need help with. So let me know what you need help with. Um, and I think I'm going to be done. Cool. Thanks so much for joining me, guys. It's such a pleasure when you join me and you engage, and I love coming on Facebook Live. So thanks for being here. I appreciate each and every one of you, and I hope I've given you a lot of hope. I hope I've given you a lot of ideas, and I hope that um, I, I hope that you know your business is going great. I, I expect it is, and if it's not, I've got a ton of resources, free and otherwise, um, to help you. So thanks for joining me. Happy Tuesday night. Uh, here's making lots of friends, making lots of money. Bye.